fortunately this year um, the University of Louisiana approached me and um, them being very south and close to the coast and also um, a D1 college it was almost a no-brainer for me to, to choose them. Um, I'm very grateful for the opportunity they've given me um, and the weather there as well is um, pretty warm all year round which is also a big a big factor as why well. I chose Louisiana. It's been a, a long journey um, but I must say I'm leaving next week and I couldn't be more excited for, for what awaits. My coach uh, from the university sent me the roster last week um, and yeah there's uh, a lot of tournaments, a lot of traveling. The one that I'm most excited for is uh, we've got a tournament in Hawaii um, at the end of the fall um, which I'm really looking forward to. I know Louisiana is really hot as well, so definitely need to pack in a few shorts and t-shirts. Um, but yeah, it's it's really been incredible. Um, everyone who's helped me along the way, I really thank them. Uh, my parents as well, and all my coaches over the years. Um, I really couldn't have done it without you guys. Growing up here as a junior, uh, I always felt welcome from uh, from the members here. Um, I feel like they always had time for me, and I really do appreciate that. Um, yeah, I really couldn't have asked for a better kind of upbringing into golf than to surround myself with the members over here. I started playing golf when I was three, three years old. Um, I was fortunate enough to grow up on the on the estate here with a golf course in my backyard. Um, so my dad always, uh, he took me out to the driving range after work. Um, and yeah, um, I mean, golf is a game where you have the highest of highs and the lowest of lows, but you have to have fun because if you're not having fun with what you're doing they, they really i don't see a point in doing it and um you also i mean to any junior who's coming up now wanting to to make golf their their kind of uh their sport um i just say don't be too hard on yourself um, yeah last year was quite a tough year for me results wise and golfing wise um trying to balance my golf with uh, my matric work but compared to this year, it's been the complete opposite. Um, and golf is a game where when you have your confidence, you feel like you'll never lose it. But when you don't have it, you feel like you'll never get it back. And it can flip so quickly, um, which happened to me. So just never give up and, and don't be too hard on yourself because you never know what will come. So with the, the beginning of this year, uh, everything just started clicking. Um, I was working really hard with my coach, um, Derek. And yeah, I'm just fortunate that this season's been good for me. I must say, it was not really expected. Um, obviously, I, I was confident, um, but it was the first time I was ever really in contention. End of 2021, um, I must say that was probably the highlights of my junior career. Um, I really liked the team format and the match play format. Um, and yeah, that was just incredible. To win it with the team, like the whole Gears and everything was, was really special. <laughs> no, I definitely won't. I've had a few people say that if I come back with an American accent, they won't talk to me. So I'm sure I'll, I'll be keeping it. I'll keep my South African accent. I, I feel like it will take a, a few weeks, if not maybe a month or two to adjust. Um, but I really like facing new challenges and new experiences. So um, I'm, I'm sure I'll be okay. I'm planning to major in um, BS Business Administration, um, but that could change. Um, I just kind of want to go or study something that involves business because uh, I'm, I'm pretty interested in that, so hopefully that goes well. I think one of the, the big things my dad has kind of told me is you need to keep up with your studies, you need to keep up with your studies. Um, so yeah, I definitely, I'm definitely planning on finishing my degree there because um, I do, I do want to have a degree. And then hopefully after that, uh, give golf a go. I know there is another South African on the team, um, so I'm really looking forward to to getting to know him better. And um, I've met, I've been speaking to a few of the, a few of the guys on the team there, and uh, they all seem really cool. So I'm really excited to get started. Again, just a big thank you to everyone who's helped me along the way. Uh, it has been a long journey, and this honestly is a, a dream come true. So thank you to everyone uh, who's ever helped me. And yeah.